Na, sziasztok, üdvözöllek titeket! Ö, egy újabb vadnyugati kalandban. Ö, folytassuk tovább a jó kis történetünket itt a Red Dead Redemption-ben. Vissza meg gyorsan a táborba hallom, mit tudunk ott csinálni. Gyi, paci, gyi! Ez mi az? Rapszolga munka. Az igen. Te azok nem is nem üzültek. Nem az, aminek látszik. Hát mit csináltok? I can't believe that worked. Yeah, well, we don't got time to celebrate. Come on. So, what's your plan anyway? Plan? Plan not to get caught. Now shut up, hurry up. You best give us some rope, partner. Hell of a business. Nem. Ha nem meneküljetek. Na, hát ez jár, ha megszöktük a törvényeje őrei elől. Azt mondja, hogy... Nem. Van-e nálatok valami értékes? Hát végül is börtönből nincsen. Ha, jó. Menjünk tovább. Jaj! Bokor. Mi van itt? Valami helypénz van rajta? Úha, van. Az nagy hiba. Na itt lehet házat rabolni? Jó, majd azt is fogunk csinálni. Mit veszek ettek itten? Say whatever you damn well please, but I tell you, if I don't get out of here soon, I'm gonna kill somebody. And if you don't stop hissing at me, I'm gonna kill you. You come near me, sailor, and I'll slice you up. You put that knife down, or you're gonna be missing a hand. What is wrong with you two? I ain't chopping vegetables for a living. Oh, I'm sorry, madam. Was there insufficient feathers in your pillow? I ain't lazy, Mr. Morgan. I'll work, but not this. Well, I ain't cooking work. <sighs> My husband and I, we shared the work. All of it. I was out in the fields. I can hunt, carry a knife, or use a gun. But I tell you, you keep me here. I'll skin this fat old coot and serve him for dinner! Watch your damn mouth, you crazy goddamn fishwife! Both of you! Who's again? Well, come with me then. You want to head out there? Run with the man? So be it. But we do more than just hunting. We're hunted. And them things hunting us, well, they got guns of their own. I ain't afraid of dying. Does not you know? You need anything, Mr. Pearson? Maybe me and Mrs. Zad are gonna take a little ride. Yeah, sure. Here's my list, and can you post this letter for me while you're there? Sure. Come on, princess. Are you coming with me then, woman? <coughs> so I've graduated from chopping vegetables to shopping. Shut your goddamn mouth. Na úgy tűnik, hogy elmegyünk bevásárolni. Na, akkor menjünk vásárolni. You cool down then yet? I guess. But I ain't no scullion. And I sure as hell ain't taking orders from that sweating half-wit. I guess we all gotta do our share, princess. 
<laughs> Where's the letter? Oh, are you reading his mail now? Oh, robbing and killing's okay, but letter reading's where we draw the line. Mm. <clears throat> Here. <clears throat> Dear Aunt Kathy. You are something else. I haven't heard from you in some time, so I pray to the Lord above that your health has not deteriorated further. Blah blah blah. It's boring. Yeah, I must always shuffle the level. Wait a sec. Listen to this. Since we last corresponded, I have traveled widely, making no small name for myself. <laughs> Before you ask, I am still yet to take a wife, but I can assure you it's not for a lack of suitors. <laughs> He ever actually even talked to a woman he ain't paid for? Oh, look. We're all hiding behind something. <laughs> and what's this? Return to Tacitus Kilgore. Oh, that. Now that's Dutch's idea. All mail to be sent to the same alias. Whatever we set up somewhere new, Strauss, he heads into town. Tells him to start expecting mail from a Tacitus Kilgore, whatever they changed it to. Here, give me that bag. We got work to do. Hey, slow down. Is it the alley you want to have? Hmm, where are you Mi van? Ja, hogy ide kell beparkolni? Aha. So, what's the plan? I shoot the shopkeeper while you. No, you insane. Ez az a szűj elő, ez a fagyvert, bazd meg. Outlaws, not idiots. We rob fools that rob other people. These people, they're just trying to get by. So you head on in there and you buy some food to eat. No guns. You're sure? This time, there'll be time for killing soon enough. What are you doing? I'm gonna go check the mail. Nothing exciting. No, I make a push the lad out. Pull up my level at the middle of the fussy. Hello, B. Not a day, guys. Fair new balloon. No. I'm sorry, Shammy. You got your mom. Yes, I would like to post a letter. All right. Let's move on. How does this letter get filled up? Okay, no trouble. Thank you. Many pins are made. Hot sauce. Uh huh. Could you visit them at the five pins? I think that we need to get those. Oh, dick. Yo. Limon, I'm going to visit them. New Hanover, I'm going to visit them. And I'm going to go to the same place. No. Come here, young guy. No, can you fill up a quota to touch the sack here? What's going on? Oh, what are you doing? Help! My sister's newborn had more strength than you. My sister's newborn had more strength than you, and he came out bright blue. I'm trying. Try harder. No, what's going on? Ennyi volt? Vagy mi van még azt a kicsi zsákot, még feldobod nekünk? Tedd már fel a hátuljába, légy szíves! Köszi! Fizess és menjünk! De most miért oda ültem? Giddy up! So, you get everything? I think so. And some new clothes, I see. Don't start. I can wear whatever I want. A yokish cinematic mood. My husband and I shared all the work. I wasn't some little wife with a flower in her hair baking cherry pies all day. Yeah, I don't doubt that. 
Well, you sure look the part now. Won't be long before you're smoking cigars and playing the harmonica. I'll have you know. I used to love playing the harmonica before. Well, my house and everything I own got burned to the ground. I know. I'm real sorry about what you... Uh, you know. Maybe I'll keep my eye out for another one. I don't want no pity. Just treat me equal and know. Nobody's taking nothing from me ever again. Mm-hmm. Just don't kill the camp cook. Please. Hey there! Opa. Hey. What, uh... What you folks up to? Just heading home. You're in Lemoyne Raider country. Keep it cool. Steve. You need to pay a toll to pass through here. No, I don't no, so. in them. You don't think so? How about you pull over right now? Pull over? That's what I said. Hey, how's about this? Hoppa. Oh, That's who you. Az igen, nem ezt akartam elővenni. <gül> Oké, okay. ezt nem. Az igen, na ezt kicsit átment rajta, baszki. Na jó, van itt egy kicsi háború lesz, úgyhogy adunk egy kis ilyen löketet magunknak. No, you took me there, Tex. Yeah, you run, you goddamn coward! I think we're good here, Arthur. I shoot you. All right. See, play with that. Take us to the bosky. Yeah, see, play with that. Take us to the. Why? Because you've caused enough trouble already. I'm fine. We showed those bastards, huh? Remind me not to get on your bad side. And they was clearly planning to bushwhack us. You did good. But that's a lot of mess to make near camp. Hope it don't bring anyone sniffing around. Are you gonna tell Dutch? Maybe. If he asks. But maybe not. Hey, watch it! So who did they say they were? Lemoyne Raiders? Yeah, something like that. Who knows? Anyway, don't you go ribbon piercing about that letter. How dare you? I wouldn't dream of it. Right, you wouldn't. I have traveled widely, making no small name for myself. I won't be giving you no mail to post anytime soon, that's for sure. <laughs> I just want to peek in that journal of yours. The mind boggles. Not a chance. So the other man is a Ilyen karakter volt. Előbb lő, aztán kérdez. You didn't get yourself killed then, Miss Adler. Not quite. Well, I'd like to say I missed your refined conversations, but I'd be lying. I, I enjoyed myself out there. Yes, we, uh, Mrs. Adler did okay. At shopping? Yes, at shopping. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Don't mention it. I would ride with you again, Mrs. Adler, if you will ride with me. Maybe, <laughs> if you prove you can handle yourself. Well, they say I lack finesse, but I ain't afraid of gun smoke. <laughs> oh, we got this, Arthur. You've already done me a big favor today. Okay, Miss High and Mighty. And nice pants, by the way. Oh, shut up. There's not coming in, Busky. Um, this is my goal. I feel I'm making me fool myself again. Uh, we've all done it, and you saved my life again. Well, maybe one day you'll save mine or my soul. <laughs> yeah, I'd like that. Don't make fun of me. Oh, I'm sorry. 
Anyway, it wasn't a complete waste of time. I stole this from one of those awful men. You should have it. I forgot him. I forgot you care. Thank you, but you were blind drunk. I was drunk, but I never forget my manners. No, Captain, you were not. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. I must have told him not to mention this idiot. Uh, hol vannak a kiszólított? Mi van? Mindegy, menjünk Dutchhoz, nézzük meg, mit akar. Hát jó, most nem is szok, köszönöm. Most beszélnem kell Dutchal. My daddy died in a field in Pennsylvania, fighting this lot. I ever tell you that? Many times. I see I'm boring you, Arthur. Worrying me. We lost men back there. We have lofty goals, Arthur. We're trying to reform society to a kinder, truer, better way. Now, of course, there's going to be casualties. We're thieves. In a world that don't want us no more. We are dreamers in an ever duller world of facts. Now I'll give you that, but come on. Mm, we have have the the day. Day. It's nice out. Old Jose says that there's a trick around here. I reckon it's full of thick. Hey, old girl, come on down here. Why don't you show us this crick you've been pissing in? Hey, you don't look too rosy, old friend. I thought this warmer weather would... My days are looking good and long over, Dutch. <laughs> Always dream crushing and bubble bursting, you. No, I can't go back to the lobby, I'm going to go to the ideal place. Come on, then. Okay, girl. Kövessük yeah, hozzá itt. Okay. Kicsit húzzál bele. Why don't we just fish here? There's a whole lake of them. Because I need to get out for a bit. Me and the old guard. Before any of them back there. Oh, there was us. The curious couple and their unruly son. It feels good here. You did well finding that spot, Arthur. More Charles than me. It's like I can breathe again. Thick and soupy as this air is. Might even do your whistling pipe some good, Hosea. I was once in this country with Bessie. Ah, feels like a lifetime ago. It was a lifetime ago. But what a life we have lived, how well we have fought. Especially both of you. I hope so. But now, when things are desperate, we have to stick with the plan. Make enough money, then find somewhere where nobody will find us. Where we don't have to hide. I got some ideas in action, but I need you with me, not against me. Both of you. Hey, but I need you with me, not against me. Both of you. Of course. Still, we do need money. So keep a low profile, especially in the local town. After Valentine, I want everyone on best behavior here. No trouble. But start turning over the soil and the rocks. See what turns up. Dutch, we've got to be discreet. Looks like law up ahead. Play it cool. Whoa! Gentlemen, well, look what the cat drug in. I seem to have gotten myself in a spot of bother. Quiet back there. Let's see if we can't sort this out. Mm-hmm. 
How are you, boys? Fine. This is quite some country you have here. We like it well enough. Hoagie McIntosh, at your service. Lee Gray. This is my deputy, Archibald McGregor. Hey, it's good to meet you. You a Scott? Partly. The best part. <laughs> of course. Now, tell me, sir, what did the silly, fancy fop back there do? Nothing too terrible, I trust. He was accused of running a gold mining investment scam. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm sure he wasn't. He is a magician. I know him. He's a fool, but he is not a bad fellow. Now, can we... Can we just... Uh... I wouldn't do that if I were you! I... Shit! I... The Anderson boys! Uh -huh. I can't handle the scandal! Na jó kis akció well, lesz meg. Well, allow us to help, my friend. Arthur! Chase wanted man. Uh, and, and take Archibald with you. Just what I signed up for. Come gyere, 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 futi, 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 futi. Pussunk kutalva. Let's go after that train. Keep your guns holstered. We need them Anderson boys alive. Come on, hurry. All right. Come on, we're losing them. Will you relax? Csit nehéz lesz utol érni a vonatot, de meg lehet próbálni. Hát jó van. Arthur Callahan. Callahan. <laughs> hazudunk, hazudunk, ezt így kell. Szállj már le a vonatról. Nincs egyed. Hova futsz? Jegyeket, bérleteket legyen szíves. Ne fussatok, nincs egyetek. Büntetés jár érte. Ne fuss el. Kis fejes. Ennyi. Hova oh, menek ősz? Nem menj el. Mi van? Késsel jössz? Na gyere! És eljössz, basszus. Ne jösszed már! Na! Üha! Kösz! Te velem szorakozó? Hogy kell, well, ki kell menni? I don't think he's dead. I think I won the fight. Ah, oh, just about. Jó, van, fölvegyük fel ezt a faszit. Bring him out here. Deputy. Sounded like quite a commotion. Is that him? I sincerely hope so. Old Anders Anderson. So what now? You take him in. Come on. A fine job. Well done. 
and a pat on the back for me for right. stopping the train. <clears throat> there you go. You are a natural. All right, let's take him in. Follow me. What about the others? Oh, we'll round them up. Anders back there is the brains of the operation, and that's really saying something. You're the boss. That was mighty impressive, sir. I have to admit. I'd hazard a guess you've served the law yourself at some point. Well, I wouldn't exactly say that. Are you familiar with the area here? No, not really. On your right here, these tobacco fields? This is part of Caliga Hall, big estate belonging to the Gray family. Looks bone dry. Yes, we are in dire need of some rain around here, let me tell you. The Greys have lived in Caliga Hall for generations. Fine people. My family's been working for them for years. Sheriff Gray's the one I know best, of course, but they own half the businesses in town. Which town? Rhodes, sir. You don't know it? Where we're headed right now. Ain't what it was before the war, but it has its charms. I'm sure you already know of the Braithwaites. Like I said, just got down here. Another big family in these parts. They have an estate west of here. Awful people, truly awful. They've been fighting with the Greys for as long as I can remember. Sounds like quite the place you got here. Oh. Here we are. Welcome to Rhodes. Up there on your left is the Rhodes Parlor House. Very reputable saloon owned by the Gray family. We also have a general store, gunsmith, post office, train station, of course. What more do you need? Very little. Oh, good. They're back. And that's your friend, right? Yep. Okay. We're gonna stop just ahead on the right, outside the sheriff's office. Can you grab Anders off your horse and carry him in for me? Sooner you get him off your horse, sooner we can get him in a cell. Carry him over then. Hey, fellas. Mr. Gray! We got him. Very good. I told you Arthur would deliver. Man has a passion for justice. That's wonderful. So, uh, about my friend here? Your idiot friend is free to go. But no more trouble from you, partner. I promise you, this was all just a big misunderstanding. However, I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart. Well, I'll pretend to appreciate that. Mr. McIntosh, it has been a real pleasure. The mostly good citizens of Rhodes, we welcome you. Well, we're just honored to be here. And make your friend behave. We got enough trouble from some of the residents, old-timers who've gone sadly to seed and lost their dignity. How terrible. Come along now. I will keep this fellow on the straight and narrow. Well, come back and see us sometime soon. Excuse me, gentlemen. Uh, Bo, these better be ugly rumors. Is it true you were seen talking to that wretched Penelope Braithwaite? I can't thank you enough. Where have you been? Around. And where are you staying? I'm renting a caravan. On the edge of town, behind the church. It's horrible, but no one comes looking. The whole town is trapped in this interminable feud between the two families. His lot, Greys, and Braithwaite's. Interesting. Two old plantation houses, and falling out of rebel gold, and marrying cousins, or not marrying... Arthur, that's what... Jose, you start poking around. See what you can find out about that. I have missed you, boys. I've heard about bounty. Well, there's been a price on my head for 13 years. It'll take a month to find us down here, and it seems like we can have a little sport. Well, they're good bounties. Where you hear this? Some fellas I met at a camp near the state line said there was talk of it in bars in the north and west for 500 miles. There was talk of super agents of some sort. Super agents? Hmm. <laughs> oh, no. It's just talk. I'm sure it is, but I couldn't not tell you. Stay out of trouble. Thank you, gentlemen. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, so these two plantation families. Arthur, you start sniffing around the Gray's place, see what the story is there. Yeah, I passed by it earlier with our friend, Archibald. Good. Hosea, you see what you can find out about these Braithwaites. All right. 
Thank you, Arthur. Quite a fishing trip. Az egy jó horgásztúra volt, holott nem is horgásztunk, de <gül> jó van. Na, most nem horgászhatok. Menjetek horgászni, azt most kihagyom. Nos, lovacskám, hol vagy? Gyere, gyere papához, hol vagy? Hol vagy? Na, itt van. Na, hát ez nem volt valami hűde akciódús, de nem baj. Nézzük meg. Aha, meg ezt akarom megszaglászni, úgyhogy szaglászunk körbe ott annál a területnél szerintem egy picit. Jó van, nem, padjál már békén. Mi folyik itt? Jó. Körbe kell nézni. What do you want, boy? This here the gray plantation? Yep. Hey, look, I've been helping the sheriff with some trouble. Wanted me to have a word with few of the folks on the property here. Emmett Lee. All right. Have a word. But I ain't got the time to help you. Obliged. Bengets. Vagy nem engedsz. Aha, jó, beengedett. Aha, kérdezősködni kell. Kérdés? Hey, uh, I was hoping you'd talk a moment. I'm a student of the history of the region and... Uh... I ain't the one to speak to. Try Master Bo. Think he's down there by the wood store. Boy's got all the time in the world. Mhm, mm jó. Ö... Aha. Viszont az élet erőm egy picit lement, úgyhogy ennem kéne valamit. Jó. Valahol itt kell legyen, elvileg. Ha hol vagy? Aha, itt van né. El van bújva a kis mocsok. Huh. I'll see you at the sheriff's office. Excuse me, friend. We friends? Not yet, but he is hoping. I guess. We don't get a lot of traveling men here, and suddenly there's a whole phalanx of mysterious but strangely helpful Yankees about the place. Is there? What are you doing here? I was just looking for work. Well, looking for something. Don't worry, your secret's safe with me. What secret? I got a secret of my own. Are you secretly normal? Excuse me? Never mind. The thing is, I don't care if you kill the whole lot of us and the Braithwaites. I don't want to kill anyone. I love her, you know. Love who? Penelope. But it's impossible. Well, love tends to be complicated. She's a great... Hát, uh, I'm a son of Bonyolult. Tavish Gray, nephew of Lee Gray, the sheriff, grandson of old Murdo Gray. We Greys have been loyal to the state and murderers to the Braithwaites for so long now, no one can even quite explain why. Beyond blind loyalty and stupidity, I'm supposed to be loyal to some nonsense while she... She's amazing. She's like a woman from the future. She's like tomorrow, if tomorrow turns out fine. Well, I'm sorry for your predicament. Would you help? I don't want to get involved in <laughs> gang feuds. Seems unseemly. I'll pay. I've got money. We Greys, we've always got money. No brains, mine, but money. Well, in that case, 
I know she loves to sit out in the gazebo on the edge of the Braithwaite property. Take her this letter and this bracelet, please. Uh huh. Oh, look out for their guards. They're worse with strangers than ours are. Aha, tehát hol fog kell elvinni? Aha. Okay. So long. And good luck. Ott az örökkel kell vigyázni. Ne vegyenek észre. De... Úgyhogy jönnek ki is. Zúzunk innen. Milyen jó kis lájt özzene. Még mindig elképesztően jó ez a játék. Jól ki van dolgozva. Yep. Oh, elvileg itt kell bemenni. Na, jó. Ö, valahol megkerüljük az egész helyet szerintem. Na jó kis zenét raktak ide. Ha örökkel vigyázzunk. Arra külön felhívták a figyelmünket. Jó, megkerüljük ezt az egészet. Lehetőleg. Jó, na jó, most meg köd is van, most meg alig látok valamit. Oda kell elmenjünk, úgyhogy... Hát idáig eljöhetek is igazából, mert... Itt vagyunk, jó... Leszállunk a lóról... Te maradj itt, jó? Az őrök, aha... Jaj, csak bírt ki, légy szíves. A staminám bírja ki. Oké. Okay. Jó lesz, jó lesz. Megvan. Well, I guess I am. I've got a letter for you. Oh. And... A gift. <laughs> a letter and a gift. Well, we don't even know each other. <laughs> well, it's not from me. It's from, uh... From Bo. <gasps> oh, he is so... Strange? Well, yes, he's a little strange, but also so human. The rest of our families are stuck in the Dark Ages, or... Well, I don't know cave people perhaps Bo's different but if they find out they'll kill him and send me to live someplace awful like Ohio have you ever been to Ohio sir no well neither have I but my uncle has a factory there he was sort of the black sheep on account of having left but now they tolerate him because he's a vicious snob families are are There's something else. <laughs> you got a family, sir? No, not really. Well, 
they tolerate him because of the money. But me, with my ideas above my station, they can't stand. That sounds pretty complicated. I, I don't know quite what to say. Well, nothing to say, except I hope they all rot. I don't. Uh, well, maybe a bit. But here, if you see Bo again, will you give this to him? Sure. Nem mi lettem én baszki postás? <gül> Hagyom el töltet a hogy észrevennének. Jó van. Hát azon vagyok baszki. Csak ez a karakter nem tud úszni. Valamiért a játékban kivették ezt az opciót, hogy úszás. Jó. Kiosanunk itt hátul. Az úgy jó lesz. Da. Tik. Oké. Az oda Penelope levelét baúnak. Na akkor menjünk oda vissza. Menjünk ide. Úgy. Ha már elkezdtem ezt, ha már vissza vagyok, ha már elkezdtem ilyen postás feladatokat végezni, ugye? Hello, ka! Tehát vágok szerintem. Valami nem tetszett neki. Mi bajotok van? Én csak el akarom hagyni a területet. Most a bácsi lettem. Jó kis játék amúgy. Hát nem most állbadták ki ezt a játékot, de a mai napig még mindig. Én, ez az én véleményem, hogy mai napig még mindig viszi a primet az a játék. A kidolgozottság, se grafikailag. Nagyon jó. Hát a Rockstar ez a játék, a kitett magáig csak sajnos nem foglalkoznak már úgy vele, hogy kellene, úgyhogy... Oké, okay, köszi. Csak meg kell nézem, hogy hol van ez a faszi. Ott van benne, nem? Aha. Most már nem tud úrani. Na, meg is jöttünk. You got my money? Sure. Did she give anything? For me? Yes. Might I have it? Sure. But it'll cost you. Ah, uh, I can't be bothered. Here, take it. Oh, thank you, Arthur. You'll... Thank you. My God. What a woman. She's... This'll get her killed, for sure. What? Women's suffrage. Around here, they don't even like men voting. They bring back the monarchy, given half the chance. Progress is a dirty word in these parts. Unlike incest. Excuse me? I don't want to marry my cousin Matilda. I want to marry Penelope. But they're gonna... They'll kill her at one of those rallies they're holding. They've done it before. Mr. You gotta help. No, I'm afraid I don't want no part of it. I'll pay. My family, we've still got some money. Fine. Just no more running around with letters. Thank you. Come on. We better get going. Mia vei fertőzés. Egy pedig és ez a faszi. Ez ezért rokonok. 
Ich hab noch nie was erlebt. Vicky. Mondjuk az elég érdekes. Ez az egész most így. Easy boy, calm down. I can't be calm. If we don't get there in time, my true love may be shot. I'm prepared to die for the cause, Bo. You know that. Do something, please. Now, what are you doing? Fight this mob. We must begin. They need me alive. This is no laughing matter. Those bastards should not make any noise. They need protecting from certain elements, mostly my family. Penelope, I beg you. I'll tell you what. Your friend here can drive the wagon for us. It'll allow us to shout all the louder. Miss Calhoun. Miss Calhoun. My friend here says he can drive the wagon. Well, Olive Calhoun. Normally I like to drive myself, but today I feel like a man joining us sends the right message. Well, I ain't never been in a protest march before, madam. Well, just treat us like the sheep. And the folks attacking us like the wolves, and I'm sure you feel right at home. Shall we go? <coughs> All right, ladies. We know our song is a good one, mm -hmm. and we know our cause is a pure one. Yes, ma'am. Let liberty reign. <laughs> We're mothers, wives, housekeepers, and daughters. We put the food and we fetch now, the now. water. Take us down Main Street, right through town to the steps of the Bank of Roads, Mr. What was your name? Arthur Morgan. Very good, Mr. Morgan. Not too quick and not too slow. We need them to hear our voice. Well, they'll hear it all right. Very good. Very good. Mr. Morgan, are you an old friend of the movement? I'm just a driver, Mrs. Calhoun. Maybe a shotgun messenger if it comes to it. I hope it won't. Well, our message will be delivered peaceably, Mr. Morgan. You can keep your shotgun to yourself. Stay on Main Street. Uh, it's a left up here, Mr. Morgan. Look at these people. It's about to get exciting. I can feel it. I believe you might be right. Good day, Sheriff. I trust you'll make sure it's a peaceful assembly. Oh, do give it a rest, you sorry fool. Mr. Morgan, I give you the mail of the species. Kis helységbe, kis tüntetés van ám. Almost there. Take us just a little further, please. Those are the steps, Mr. Morgan. Stop in front there, and then all you need to do is listen. Ladies, get down! Go home! Come on! Go home! Shut your mouth! What the hell is going on? Well, man! Hey, ho! Who made that fire for the last one? That's a hong solo. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this is a great day for all of us. For today is the day we begin to live as equals. Equals! Yes, equal, sir. Fair and equal. This is unnatural. This is nonsense. Fair, equal, and free, just as the founding fathers intended. Founding fathers, not founding mothers, you silly old goat. His philosophy dependent on biology. What the hell are you doing here, boy? Keep your voice down. I'm trying to listen to the speech. Hello, darling cousin. Don't you ever speak to me like that. What are you doing here? Listening. 
I suppose. Go help Bo. His cousin is a moron. And stop them from ruining the speech. You need to learn yourself some manners, cousin. Haven't you got anything better to do? Oh, you always was. Bo, why don't we just leave him? Well, who the hell is this? Follow me, Ron. What? You'll hit me? Come on. Can you not see? Bully us. Come on, Bo. Let's go. Quick now. We got to go before they think twice. Oh Lord. Follow me. I know a place. It's an old battlefield. No one goes to. You don't want to go back and hear the speeches? I ain't voted before, but kind of getting hot for voting. <laughs> I don't know whether to take you seriously, Mr. Morgan. My cousins are my primary concern right now. If everyone knows about Penelope and me, <sighs> everyone knows about Penelope and you. I know about Penelope and you, and I've been here all of ten minutes. The sooner it's out, the sooner it's resolved. The sooner it's dealt with, you mean. We're dealt with. Our families, the Greys and the Braithwaites, we bury our secrets, and we bury them deep. Your secrets and your treasure. You know, Catherine Braithwaite's got a daughter. No one's seen her in years. She weren't right, you know, and Penelope said... Uh, I, I ain't heard about daughters. I heard about gold. But Yankee gold? I fear that's just a story, Mr. Morgan. But I don't know. This is awful. Nobody died. It ain't that awful. My cousins are vindictive bastards. My brothers are vindictive bastards. My cousins are worse. They started it. I know. But you should leave. I will. As soon as I have enough money. When my family, we have money, but I don't. Is your family very rich? Yes, well, I believe so, but uh, they keep me out of the discussions. I have more of a artistic temperament, so... Oh, is that what they call it? Yes. Oh, you made a joke. Mm. I really love her. I do. Well, stick around. Maybe you can die for her as well. I thought you were trying to make me feel better. <laughs> Look, I gotta go. Me too. Oh, damn! I'm gonna be late. My uncle is quite as bad as you would imagine. Oh, here, your payment. Thank you. Excuse me. No, hát legalább kifizetett. Hát mennyit kerestünk ezzel? Hát sokat nem hiszem. 30 dollár. Az igaz szerelem útja. Hát az még távol, tőlem távol áll, de jó van az úgy. Na. Nézzük. De most ne fussál, ho, ho, állj meg. Mi van itt a közelbe? Uh -huh. Dutch. Na, no. menjünk be Dutchihoz. Na, hát... Uh, én itt most befejezem szerintem, úgyhogy... Uh, Köszönjük, hogy nézted. És hogy uh, velem tartottál ebbe a videóba. Ha tetszett, iratkozz a csatornára, lájkod a videómat. Hát a következő részben találkozunk. Sziasztok, szavasztok!